This review has been approved by Lord Carnage. Banished from Earth Classic Game Room broadcasts from the Intergalactic Space Arcade on its never-ending mission to review everything. Welcome to Classic Game Room, where I have a game that's very region-specific. In fact, you can only enjoy it in California. After all, it's California Games for the Master System. Stop looking at the girl in the bikini. They must have hired some pretty unattractive models for their photo shoot. Notice all their heads are cut off. It's California Games! From 1987, back when we were watching movies like North Shore. And wearing OP t-shirts. Nice catch! Gnarly! This is such an 80s game. Back when cool sports like BMX, bicycle, hacky sack, and skateboarding were becoming all the rage. Sadly, California still suffers from an earthquake problem, thanks to Superman's incompetence. It's like a view to a me killing it at surfing here. The only sport I'm actually good at. In this video game, the only sport I'm good at in real life is frisbee. Yes, I can throw and catch frisbees a lot better in real life than this game, which is pretty tough, actually. California Games is like a precursor to Tony Hawk Pro Skater and a collection of mini games. There's a bunch of stuff to do here, including frisbee, BMX, biking, and hacky sack. Or, or foot bag, as they call it. I think a Klingon bird of prey should just land on that guy and squash him while cloaked. You know where I'm going with that one. I hate foot bag. And everyone who plays it. Incompetent barefoot trust fund hippies. Does your hacky sack bag match your Range Rover? I hope so. Otherwise, I'm sure that ruins your day. Now, let's talk about something more exciting, like BMX biking. Whoa, tubular. Bogus. Is, is that the music from Batman? Sounds just like it. This one's actually pretty good. This, this could have been an entire game in and of itself. But no, California Games gives you five plus... That other one that we'll just ignore. Kinda reminds me of TNC Surf Factory, a game I played a lot on my NES. Even the roller skating's pretty good here. You push up and down to skate, and then you can jump over things and land flat on your face. While this looks and sounds really good on the Master System, the controls are a bit of an acquired taste. Most of the games play the same. You move around and then... Use some combination of the buttons to pull off different tricks for points. Some games are better than others. The surfing is probably the best, followed by BMX biking, roller skating, then frisbee, skateboarding, and that hippie sport we shall not mention. <laughs> you yuppie scum. I like my OP trophy that I won by coming in first place. Out of one person, that's not bad. You can play this with a bunch of your friends, and maybe that's the best way to enjoy California games. Also, maybe it was the best way to enjoy it in the 80s. Because other than nostalgia, I can't really recommend that you run out and play this one again. It's kind of neat, but part of its charm has worn off over time. I would have loved this one back in 1989. These days, there's far better games on the Master System to choose from. Although you should still be wearing an OP t-shirt while playing them. So as my biker recovers from a concussion and my surfer is eaten by sharks, I have a classic game room shout out and thank you to send to Francesco from Rome, Italy. Thank you for sending California games to the show. How did this work in Rome? <laughs> Radical. The Master System version is excellent. The cover art is hysterical. I like that dude's knee pads, they look pretty stylish. It's a competent effort from the era, but I'd rather watch North Shore instead. With a late 80s version of Nia Peoples, definitely beats this game. 